Uh, type 1 diabetes is when your body's pancreas is attacked, an autoimmune disease. So your own cells attack the pancreas and kill off all the insulin producing cells. So the only way that you get insulin is through an injection. Sir, can you uh, come sit down? <laughs> oh, okay. All right, so um, what's your name? Uh, my name is Jesse Elsweger, and I've had type 1 diabetes since I was three years old. And can you tell us what happened when you were diagnosed? Well, I started, we started to notice symptoms like I started drinking a lot of water constantly. Uh, I started fe feeling very dehydrated and sick and lethargic. Does it usually affect your daily life? Somewhat, but not really. I usually just go on like a regular person. So what I do here is I take the test strips and I put it into the meter. And this is a little poker. It's got a little needle inside right there. And when I want to prick my finger to draw a little bit of blood, that's all it takes. And then you apply it to the strip. Hmm. 379. And that is? That is very high. That is a normal blood sugar. Well, what you do is once someone is diagnosed with type 1 diabetes, you want to keep their blood sugar in a range. Uh, normal blood sugar is between 70 and 180, especially in kids, and they change it to 70 to 150 as they get older. But you try to keep it in that range at all times as best you can. Um, when a blood sugar goes low, so basically that's when it goes to below 70, you want to get a fast-acting carbohydrate in the body as soon as possible. So usually, like with Jesse, with our son, we give him about 15 grams of carbohydrates really quick like a juice and then a, a long acting snack. So you need to get that blood sugar elevated back up. When your blood sugar is high, it's exact opposite. What's happening is your body has too much sugar in its system and anything you're eating or drinking is going right through your system so no, none of the nutrition is getting absorbed. So you need to take insulin to counteract all the extra sugar in your body. So what I need to do is I take out my insulin pump which has a little cord that goes down into my body. And what I do is I just push these buttons to say how much insulin I want. And insulin Ins would make it the blood sugar go down. Insulin is a liquid that is pretty much my medicine that makes my blood sugar go down. And when else do you use this insulin? Uh, when I'm about to eat. I'm about to do 3.5 units and then I'll press X. And the insulin is now going into my body. How do you feel about Jesse having diabetes? Well, um, it just seems like every time he tries. Um, well, he has to keep his, he has to eat um stuff. So and he has to drink diet soda, so his blood sugar doesn't get high. Go diabetes! Everybody, keep on rocking. Everybody, just come on, share.